Hello, welcome back to Brenda Sushi Left Noting. In this episode, I want to explain um, a new notes in Geometry Notes called Material Assign. So Material Assign is actually in, in the latest version of Blender 3.0 Alpha. So we have actually now Material Assign and Material Replace. So Replace is pretty simple and you basically can replace it. Replace like a vertex with another material. So you can have maybe if we replace the yellow with this uh, blue color this should work yeah so yeah all right that's neat but what's really interesting here is material assign node that's basically it operates on this default cube and if the monkey head is too close to the cube it's changing the material as you can see also in this evaluated uh, spreadsheet there is a value which is blah and there's a value blah x okay this one is kind of like a boolean on and off and it's changing the material based on the distance this monkey influencing the box okay so if I ever want to do the same uh, I can just repeat the setup but before I go there what's what's actually happening I'm using the attribute proximity so we have this object right this monkey influence one relative to our default cube and from this attribute with this attribute proximity we created an attribute called blah and this blah I use attribute compare uh, and then the result is blah x I'm comparing the positions, points position of Susan, the monkey head influence, and I'm assigning this to a value. I'm actually I'm comparing it. So there's this value that I can change. That's basically comparing it into the point position of Susan. But anyway, the result is blah x. If we are using something like point distribute, so this is like a different, totally different totally different result but we have, we have seen something like this in the past if we look at the evaluated point cloud okay eh, wait. there I think this is the most useful spreadsheet value we can see the with the point cloud that we cannot see the position is changing the radius and there's this attribute that we are passing into the next process if we point instance it we can instance the icosphere and get this instance object but in this case we are not using point so I'm just using the geometry itself with the same attribute la x okay so if I want to do the same thing let's tidy this a little bit so one two three four duplicate it pass our geometry it should be like this we want to have two influence monkey this monkey we have influence number two so we have two influencer so this is a pretty interesting uh, it's, it's a really simple setup but uh, still uh, I think this should be in the in the example of geometry nodes let's try to So this is basically material assigned. So it's assigning it into this object and we can check the result from vertex. So it's changing the value on the fly and the material is also changing on the fly. See the material index? Yep. So I think this is what, it, what it's doing. Anyway, we can always replace it. With another thing so yellow like I said 
Yeah, I think even though this object doesn't have blue, it still can be assigned with another material. So I can have blue over here. Just call it blue. Or just in this case in purple. Yep. In fact, um, maybe the second monkey will give a purple color. All right, now we are rocking. So the original default cube is pink. We have yellow coming in and we have purple coming in. Now we are all blending together. Cool. Okay, that's basically my example. Hopefully you find this uh, useful and interesting. Thanks again for tuning in and I'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye.